If you're using Microsoft Project, you can synchronize your tasks and actual work with Standard Time. Now there is a little plug-in or an add-in that goes into Microsoft Project, goes into the ribbon, and allows you to perform that synchronization. Uh, now this is not a requirement. You can use Standard Time independently of Microsoft Project, but this little plug-in will allow you to synchronize uh, MPP files or Project Web Access, whatever Microsoft Project file you have open, you can synchronize that with Standard Time. So let's spin around here and take a look at how that would work. There are multiple ways to synchronize tasks in actual work between Microsoft Project and Standard Time. So in this video, we're going to look at the Standard Time plugin or add-in that goes into Microsoft Project. Before we get into that, let's take a look at, uh, first of all, I've got a simple test project here with half dozen tasks, resources assigned. I'm looking at the work and actual work columns because those are most important for synchronization. If I go to the view menu, click task usage, you can see I'm also looking at the work and actual work columns and I've right clicked here to choose the actual work field in the uh, details because that's where the hours are going to come into Microsoft Project from standard time. So uh, again, back to the Gantt chart. As soon as I perform the synchronization, you're going to see all of these tasks over in standard time. And then we can type some hours into the timesheet and get them back into Microsoft Project. So let's click the Project tab. And over on the right-hand side, you see a new button that's added here for the plugin. And that allows you to synchronize with standard time. So I'm going to click that. The first thing it wants to do is know which project we're going to synchronize with or integrate with. And I'm going to choose to create a new project. Uh, this by default comes up with the name of my Microsoft Project file. I'm not going to choose a client just yet. Just create the project and then click OK to synchronize. So now that the synchronization is done, we're going to see all of these tasks over in standard time. So let's switch over and see what happened. So we see a new project here in standard time. List of our tasks, you see them all listed here with the links. The duration column is equivalent to the work column over in Microsoft Project, and then you have your actual work. So there's zeros in all of these tasks because we haven't typed anything into the timesheet. So let's uh, go ahead and type some hours into the timesheet. I'm gonna open up this project and I'm only going to see the tasks that are assigned to me. And that's the resource assignment that you have over in Microsoft Project. So let's type some hours into some of these tasks. And we'll switch to another user here and just put some hours in for that user as well. So now I've got some time in for myself and Buzz. And I can go back to Microsoft Project, click that button for the plugin, and that'll perform the synchronization. But I wanted while I was here to show you that there are other ways to get time over into Microsoft Project and perform that synchronization. And one way is to go to the View menu and choose Refresh Project Tasks. Now this is not using the plugin. This is native within standard time. So if I pick this, you see this project here. I can click Refresh Now, and it would do the same thing. It would pull down the latest tasks. It would send the the actual work over to project. But I'm not going to do it here. I'm going to do it in project so you can see that plugin. So back to Microsoft Project. Again, we're looking at the project tab. Click this button again. And now the synchronization is done. You can see the actual work column has some values filled in that came from standard time. If I go to the view menu, click task usage, you again see the actual work column with some values. And then you see the values that came over from standard time in this uh, task usage view. So that is the time scale data that came over from standard time. So you've got a nice little synchronization of the tasks and the actual work back and forth using a plugin right here in the project tab in Microsoft Project.